Well, just take a look behind me. This is no ordinary Monday morning, but that's because this is no ordinary Monday. I'm Tom Walsh in Vancouver, and this is Solar Eclipse 2017. You're shaky, look at that. <laughs> that's, how, that's how wild this is for me right now. A wild experience indeed. An eclipse doesn't happen every day, and it's why thousands came out across Vancouver and the country to witness this solar spectacle. Uh, it's my second one uh, in my lifetime, and uh, it's pretty cool. Um, it was really great. <laughs> it's really cool. Well, it's just a fascinating experience. Eh? There you are. You can see it happening. It's tiny, but it's happening. It may have looked tiny here, but for those millions who braved the crowds in Oregon, they were treated to a full eclipse. Look, it's getting light again. Look how weird. Here in Canada, Toronto saw 70% and Vancouver 85. With clear skies, viewing conditions were perfect, especially if you have a giant telescope. It's so cool. Yeah? Yeah, it's orange. <laughs> and for those who didn't, cereal boxes or even coffee cups provided a simple but safe way to view. So you just poke a tiny hole and you got your own projector in your hand. You can see the eclipse. Let's see if we can get a good view. The total event only lasted a couple of hours. The next full eclipse in North America won't be until 2024. And I'm sure it'll be another crazy, wild experience. Like, I saw an eclipse. I saw the sun get blocked out by the moon. Like, if you think about that fact, that's insane. That is crazy. Tom Walsh, City News, Vancouver.